I'm Stacy Kaiser. I'm a licensed psychotherapist and expert for AOL. Today I want to talk about a very bittersweet time for parents. It's that moment where your child has gone off to college or joined the military or has gotten married and now your house is quiet and empty. Here are some of my tips for dealing with an empty nest. Tip number one, negative feelings are normal. In all likelihood, even though you may be happy, you might also be feeling sad or angry or scared about their future. It's important for you to let yourself have those feelings. Get the emotions out and don't stuff it inside. Tip number two, reach out to a friend who is either going through the same experience or has been there before. They're a great shoulder to cry on and they might have tips and suggestions for how you can deal with that empty nest feeling. Tip number three, Look for new ways to connect to your older child, whether it's sending them things that you found online that remind you of them, sending them photos of a restaurant that's their favorite that you happen to be eating at, contacting them to talk about a television show you used to watch together. Find ways to integrate your life with theirs. Tip number four, remind yourself of upcoming events you have to look forward to whether it's their graduation, their wedding day, a new grandchild. Think about things that you can look forward to that will also put a smile on your face. So the more happy things you think about, the easier it will be to manage this difficult transition.